Tropical Smoothie Cafe. I got the Sunshine Smoothie. It's so good. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nishali. For those of you who don't know me, I am making a video today. What is in my travel bag? It's just a quick little video. I'm going on a trip to Portland, Oregon. On Monday I'm leaving and I just wanted to show you what I carry in my travel bag. I will link everything down below. Let's jump in. The bag that I have, you know what? I don't think I know the name of this bag. I don't think I know the name of this bag. But anyways, this is what the bag looks like. My mom got me this from Anthropology. I'll try to link it down below if I find something similar. This is the bag I am taking with me to the airport. It's heavy. I'm just gonna dig in. I'm just gonna grab whatever comes up first. I'm looking at napkins right now. I have Kleenex for allergies because even though it's November, the allergies still strike me. Then I have in that same little pouch, I have the Jergens Ultra Healing Hand Cream. Then I obviously have some hand sanitizer. I always, always use the Purell brand. I think it's the best brand. I don't know why, I just have a thing and I think it's the best one. Then I have an extra battery. I have a little candy, it's so good. A little guava candy. I have a little Michael Kors pouch that came off of one of my other purses. In here, I have feminine products, some bite and itch relief, some roto drops. These are legit the best drops in the whole world. I have some Aura Gel, some off. This, um, it's an aromatherapy inhaler. It's really, really great stuff um, for allergies. I just take it and it's and it's amazing. You're supposed to stick it up your nostril, but I'm not gonna do that on camera. Then I have a little perfume bottle. It is a C by Giorgio Armani, and I really like this. It smells so good. Yeah, that's all this in this little pouch. I have my wallet, and this is just a basic Michael Kors wallet, wristlet-ish kind of thing. IDs, cards, all kinds of stuff. I have my little, um, what is this? It's a, I can't think. Where is my brain gone? It's gone. This is where I put the SD card. When I finish filming on the camera, I take it out, I put it in here, plug it into my computer, and upload everything to my computer with this little magic thing. I obviously have my cell phone charger my MacBook charger, nothing exciting, my computer, my planner, it says dream big, work hard, and make it happen, girl boss, I have some band-aids for blisters and etc. if I get hurt, because I'm a little accident prone, just a little bit, yeah, I have a leave, liquid gels because these are literally the only ones that work for me. I leave liquid gels and they're the best. They work really fast. If anyone has like horrible, horrible like cramps or like, headaches or whatever, I leave liquid gels. The liquid gels are the ones that work instantaneous. Almost like give it 10 minutes and you'll already start to feel a difference. I have my earphones. These are the Bose Sound True over the ear headphones and I've had these for several years now and they still are amazing. I had to replace the the ear pads, little gushy things, I had to replace them because they kind of peel. And I just put like a zipper to protect the top part. Um, they are literally the best headphones ever. My absolute favorite headphones, they're so comfortable and I love them. They're cute. They're not wireless. They have the cable and I have the attachment here because, you know, Apple comes out with all kinds of different things and you have to get adapters and attachments and all kinds of stuff. There's one way to make money. These are the best headphones ever. I just have like little knickknacks and stuff. I have like pens, which nobody cares about pens. I have um, AirPods in here. 
Um, I have some cuticle oil. I have my fossil watch. I have a bunch of scrunchies in here. I have chapstick, some extra little earplugs. I have an extra Apple, well, it doesn't have to be Apple, but an extra USB charger head. Sometimes you're just lack thereof these things. So yeah, just basically random stuff that I have in that pocket. Um, and that's pretty much it. Like I was thinking of taking my book. However, my purse is already like super heavy. And I don't know. It's this book here. The Victim by Max Manning. It's actually really good. I am on chapter 32. Me and my, well, my cousin got this for me as a present. I told her not to get it for me because I didn't like to read, but she got it anyway. She insisted. She insisted on getting it for me. So we got, I got it. <sighs> Reading this book, literally the first book I've read because I don't like to read. I really don't. I'd rather listen to podcasts. I don't like to read. I don't. <laughs> And this is what the bag looks like empty, oh, but it looks like this. It has like this middle pocket for the laptop. And then I put the laptop charger in here. Then it has um, two pockets. Oh, you can see. It has two pockets here, the zipper here. Then when you turn it over, there's two more pockets here. So that is that. Well, I didn't show this, but obviously my phone. Oh. It's almost the same color as my sweater. Oh, never mind. Also, I have a fanny pack, but I don't know if I should show you what's in my, I mean, it's nothing crazy. Like, I'll have my phone in there, my passport in there, some gum probably. Um, I'll definitely put my camera in my fanny pack. This is a fanny pack I have. This one's from Herschel. And I love the inside, it's like striped red. You can see, it's like a striped red, it's really pretty. Um, and I really like it. Let's see. Oh, so I'll carry my camera in here and I'll also carry my tripod in here. This is really big, spacious. So yeah, I'll have my passport in here, some gum in here. I'll have my tripod in here. I'll probably have my extra batteries in here. People will think it's dumb to take a fanny pack and a purse, but and that's all I have in there. If you have any questions, comments, anything that you might want to know about me or about this video, about any of the items that I showed, please leave a comment down below and be sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.